What is up guys, Bloxwest here, and welcome back to another video. I just got back from vacation, and I am super stoked, because, as you can see, we are doing, we are finally doing the Minecraft Story Mode. I know, for the past two years I've said we were going to do it this time, then that time, and this time, but we're fine, and each time it didn't happen, but we're finally doing it now, as you can see. Now, this video, hopefully I can get uh, enough of the first ep episode of the game in this that it won't be, that um, it will be, you know, within a reasonable amount of time of the actual video. So let's just get started here. Uh, and so, for those of you who don't know about Minecraft Story Mode, it, it is made. It is um, um, by it was made by Telltale Games, and uh, it is an interactive game. You aim it that the story gets tailored by how you, by the choices you make and stuff. Yeah. So, without further ado, let's get started. I like that music. Let's go. I love this intro. Okay. Pick that. Start episode one. Nothing built can last forever, and every legend, no matter how great, fades with time. With each passing year, more and more details are lost, until all that remains are myths, half-truths. To put it simply, lies. And yet, in all the known universe, between here and the Far Lands, the legend of the Order of the Stone endures unabridged as self-evident fact. Indeed, it is only a troubled land that has need for heroes, and ours was fortunate to have, so long ago, four heroes such as these. Gabriel the warrior, before whose sword all combatants would tremble. Eligard, the redstone engineer, whose machines would spark an era of invention. Magnus the Rogue, who would channel his destructive creativity for the benefit of all. And Zoran the Architect, builder of worlds and leader of the Order of the Stone. These four friends together would give so much to gain their rightful place as four heroes. Their greatest quest would take them on a dangerous journey to fight a mysterious creature known as the Ender Dragon. In the end, the Order of the Stone emerged victorious and the dragon was defeated. Their story complete, they slipped away into the pages of legend. I love that intro. But when one story ends, another one begins. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah. Would you rather fight a hundred chicken-sized zombies or ten zombie-sized chickens? Zombie-sized chickens. Yeah. Just to be clear, you wouldn't have any weapons yeah. or armor. I'd have to go with the giant chickens. Not, Not because, because I want to, to or because I think it would be easy, but because they it would, would be, be an, abomination. an abomination. Imagine their giant feet. Like I said, an abomination. So, I've got a daylight sensor on the roof. Mm -hmm. And if I did this right, these lamps should turn on once it gets dark. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to just leave Reuben here with nothing while we're at the building competition. He's coming with us. Really? Yeah, what what kind pay. of question is that? Of course he is. Okay, I'm not saying he shouldn't come. I'm not. But don't you think it's a little weird that you take him with you everywhere you go? No. He kind of makes us look like... 
I don't know. Amateurs. Ruben's my best friend. I thought I was your best friend. Both of you are. I didn't mean anything by it. So. I really like about this game. Is. That. It looks. Really amazingly like Minecraft. Exactly like it. And, you know, I never thought they would be able to make a game like this and still, and still have it look like Minecraft, like so much like Minecraft. Anyway, so what I like to do I'm glad he's coming. I just don't want to... Is, I like... I like to do stuff that will make Olivia annoyed. I don't know why, I just do. Maybe it's because she has those glasses or whatever they are. I don't know. I just, I just, you know... I like making people in the game annoyed. Not necessarily just Olivia, but Axel as well. I, I do stuff to an... The only person in this game that I don't like to have my character annoy is Ruben. Because he's really sweet. So. And you will see that as we go along. Give people one more reason to call us losers. I'm getting tired of it. I'm tired of being a laughing stock. We are, we not, are not losers, losers Olivia. Olivia. We lose all the time. It's okay. what we do. That oh, might okay, be true. that might be true. I can't remember the last time we've won anything. But if but that's, that's the case, just, it, it means, means we win, win at, at being, being losers. losers. <laughs> all right. Fine. Did you hear that? Oh, by, by the way, um, after I played through this game the first time, after that, I noticed that sometimes, like, the character will, like, cut out, out bits of what the characters are saying. And so, if some things are like, wait, what? That doesn't make any sense. That's because it's cutting out little bits of, um, of what the characters are saying. I really hate that. Hopefully, it won't. Okay. You okay? Anyway, so, uh, man, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, so, but hopefully it won't do that while I'm, uh, in these videos, so let's just hope for the best. And, also, I'm sorry if I annoy some of you guys by continuously pausing so I can talk, but, so I'll try to do that less often. And, let's just continue. I really like this game. I hope you guys like watching me play it. Oh, no. Boom! <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. You guys totally freaked out. Now we're gone. Oh. Axel, what's the matter with you? Great. Now I'm going to smell like a pig in Endercon. Cool mask. It is, isn't it? Yeah, very convincing. Look on your faces. Did you bring the fireworks? Of course I did. I even brought something for the little guy. Nice. You brought Reuben a disguise? Um, we're going to a convention. Somebody's got to wear a costume. <laughs> he looks awesome. It only took me like a million hours to build it. All right, all right. You definitely brought the fireworks, right? Yes, I'm ready. Waiting on you guys. If he was really your best friend, you wouldn't let him go outside dressed like that. The only thing more dangerous than putting a costume on a pig is trying to take it off. <laughs> Hurry up and grab your stuff. We'll meet you downstairs, okay? Okay. And here we go. 
Use your mouse to look around. Stuff, yeah. Give me a dragon roar, Reuben. <laughs> That'll do, Reuben. That'll do. Let's see what's in here. Shears definitely taking these. Never know when I might need to shear some sheep. Oh, you'll have to shear some sheep. Shear some sheep. Shear some sheep. Very soon. Wait, is that a poster with a pear on it? One of these days, we're gonna win the Endercon building competition. And when we do, oh, people will look to be, at us and say, uh, hey, Sandcastle there's Jesse and Ruben, winners of the Endercon building competition. They really should change the name. in here. Hmm, flint and steel, not too shabby. So, you know, I might, I've decided, you know, I'm, I'm not going to try to annoy all of the people that are in the game. I'll, I'll just do that on my own time, but I'll play it, but I'll play it, like, actually, <laughs> As if I'm a DC person. Which, of course, I am. That's everything. Let's roll. Yeah, dude. Roll. Let's go. I heard a pretty juicy rumor about the building competition, but you guys have to promise not to say anything. Okay. <laughs> also, it's in two parts. Each part more exciting than the last. Spit it out, Axel. Part one. The special guest at this year's Endercon is none other than Gabriel the Warrior him freaking self. Whoa, what's part two? Part two, according to my sources, the winner of the building competition is going to get to meet him. It doesn't mean anything if we lose. But if we win, oh man, this would make up for all the losing. Meeting Gabriel would be a dream and an honor. Totally, he's awesome. It'd be amazing to meet him. Reuben better be careful in that costume. The last time Gabriel saw a dragon, it didn't end well. So, does this source of yours make posters for a living? Huh? Yeah, my uh, source uh, doesn't exist. You guys are my only friends. Guys, let's stay focused. We have a competition to win. We this never win. win. And this year we've got Reuben with us. We basically have no chance. Faith, Olivia. What? A little slice, a sliver, a portion, just a little faith. That's all we need. Also, I'm hungry. To a win. No, no, I'm with that. All right. Wait a minute, wait a minute. We're thinking about this all wrong. The point of the building competition isn't just to build something. We have to do something to get noticed by the judges. Okay, then. So how do we do this? We don't just build something build a functional. Creeper we on build top something of the firework fun. Dispenser. After we finish the fireworks machine like we planned, then we build something cool on top of it. We might be onto something. If we want to get a reaction out of the judges, you build something scary. So I say we build a creeper. Wouldn't an Enderman be better? I'm more scared of Endermen than creepers. They both have their moments. Both pretty scary. All right, let's build the creeper. You're going with Axel's idea? What's wrong with my idea? Nothing. It could be totally cool. It is cool. Yeah. I think this is the first time we've decided on something before getting to the competition. Um, you guys were already we've got everything on we need? making a It wouldn't hurt to grab a little machine? more. Let's get to grabbing then. So... We're so prepared. We can't lose. Cannot. Bring it in. <laughs> Dare to prepare on three. No, no, no. Preparing is... Jesse? Daring. No, that's, that's I the same you. thing. Forget it. A team on three. One, two, three. Team! I, I love this little part here. Just look at Ruben while we're doing this. Just watch Ruben.
So guys, I just want to say, when they said, I think this is the first time we've ever agreed on something before we, before we got to the competition, what are, you, what are they talking about? They've already, they, they've already agreed on making a fireworks dispen, uh, machine, and then they just agreed on adding something to it. That doesn't mean they didn't already agree. It's just it's weird. We know. And I'm gonna try not to speak during cutscenes, so, yeah. What we're building, we've got all the stuff for it, we are so ready. This year, it's going to be different. I'm not just ready to build, I'm ready to win. Nice pig, losers. And just like oh, that, Oh, great. There's Lucas and the Ocelots. The rivalry continues. Man. They've got matching leather jackets and everything. So cool. Well, well, well. If it isn't the order of the losers. <laughs> Great. <laughs> the fail squad's here. Lucas, get a load of these losers. Let's go, guys. Name, please. Axel. And uh, how do you do? No, your team name. Team name? We are not ready for this. So much for losing anonymously. We're the Dead Enders. Whoa. Sounds like a name for pirates. What does it mean? Okay, Dead Enders. You guys are. See? See? You guys are in booth five, but you guys are. Ah! Ah! I told you, I told you it does that. It's always the same spots as, as well. Is that a freaking beacon? They have a freaking beacon? Freaking beacon? That's Stained they glass. Have a freaking beacon, they aren't just building a beacon. They're building a rainbow beacon. So ours is way cooler. We're gonna lose. Our design is better. A creeper that shoots fireworks is cooler than a fancy light. Their difficulty score is going to be higher than our total score. We've got something they don't. Fireworks. We should probably stop staring at them. Ha ha ha. Look, it's the Order of the Losers again. <laughs> Good one, Gil. We're just looking. There'll be plenty of time for you all to look at it after it wins and gets shown at Endercon. You're being unpleasant. Maybe not all of you. Endercon doesn't allow outside food or drink. <laughs> I'm talking about your pig. Shut up. Shut up. What's that? Jesse said, shut up. Do you need to hear it again? I don't know. Maybe. Stop wasting your time, Aiden. We've got work to do. You're lucky I'm busy. Hey, Jesse. Guys. Hey, Petra. How's the bill going? Only time will tell, but we're optimistic. Hey, Petra. I forgot to thank you for that nether star. Hey, Lucas. Not a problem. You help these tools? For the right price, I'll help anyone. If you need anything, you know where to find me. Nobody knows where to find None you. None of us know where to find you. Exactly. exactly. No hard feelings, guys. 
And if you're cool with Petra, you're cool with us. So why don't we just forget about all this and, you know, make this about how cool our builds are. May the best team win. Careful what, Careful you, what you wish for. for. We'll see about that. Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen, welcome to the EnderCon building competition. The winners of this year's competition will have their build featured at EnderCon. The winners will also meet in person Gabriel the Warrior. Ocelot! 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 Whoa, handshake? We don't have a handshake. We'll just make one up. We'll call it the... Uh, the Grief, the grief or, grab. or Grab. I know. Stupid name, I know. Nobody mm. will remember that. And just like that, I'm nervous again. Don't talk like that. We can do this. Just stick to the plan and everything will be fine. This year, the Dead Enders can't lose. Let's do it. Building starts now. now. You know, you know what they should add to Minecraft? You know what they should add to Minecraft? They should oh, add no. special creepers that shoot dispenser. fireworks. I'm so scared. That shoot fireworks you worry at about your build, explode. we'll worry about ours. I'm just saying. I'm, I'm literally you spamming the Q button right now. I'm going like this. All of those look stupid. And now, the, the moment, moment of, of truth. truth. Here goes nothing. Oh man, that looks so cool. We'll win this for sure. The creeper was definitely the right way to go. Hey, cool build, man. Guys, people are looking at us. Good build, man. What? No way. It's just a bunch of dyed wool. Whoops. <laughs> Oh, oh no, no Ruben's on fire! Ruben, no, come back! It was Aiden. That the part. lava's getting closer. It's gonna ruin the build. Ruben's going to get lost. We've got to do something. But our build is about to go up in flames. You guys stay and save the build. On it. We've got to cover, Jesse. Be careful. We'll meet up with you at Endercon. <laughs> Because I told them to stay there and save and save if the build, they, I mean, uh, Ruben, our team. Where are you? Just give me an oink if you can hear me. If I had said come help me find Ruben, then our build would have gone up in flames, and Lucas's, t Lucas and the ocelots would have won. Hmm, pig tracks. Ruben, Ruben, Ruben come here, boy. Yo, Ruben, I don't want to be out here in the dark. Looking, looking for a pig, yeah. <laughs> looking, looking, looking for a pig, yeah. These definitely belong to a pig. Hmm, there's no way Ruben made these on his own. Yes, yes. That looks like four or five pigs, I, I, I would say. But you know, I'm I hear like some pigs. Yeah, the carrot. Hey, Reuben. I got a carrot for you. Where are you, buddy? Spooky dark woods. Spooky, spooky, spooky. What? Reuben, are you in there? I was right. One, two, three, four, five pigs. I said four or five pigs. Five pigs. Reuben, where are you, buddy? I know he's. I know he's not in the shrubbery. Yeah. <laughs> Stupid chickens. Reuben. Yeah. Reuben, buddy, where are you? 
Ruben, it's getting scary out here. Ruben. Oh my, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Ruben. 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 Oh no, you in there, buddy? Jeez. Man, I oh, feel like it's Jeez, please don't be smaller. toasted, Ruben. I do like me some barbecue. Ooh, I do like me some. Uh, but I, I do love of as love of my barbecue pork. You know, I'm just gonna. Uh, I feel like I really wanna. Uh, Can you hear me, boy? Spoil something that happens in episode, like in the fourth episode of the game, because they release like epi episodes of the game. Like, I guess you could cut the episodes are kind of like chapters. Um, I think they released the first one. Ruben, there you are. Uh, they're. I think all hey, of them buddy, are Hey, buddy, you want a carrot? Um, I only have one through five, though. Because I have yet to purchase the Adventure Pass, which gets you uh, six, seven, and eight. Let's get out of here, Reuben. Hope you're ready for some more walking. We gotta hurry back to town if we don't want to run into... <gasps> into those. Zombies! Is that Zambonies? Reuben, run! Run, Reuben! I think, I think we're good. I think we made it. Yeah. So I have to shoot the arrow keys in with, or whatever in order to uh, dodge stuff. Like Get back! Stay behind me. I've got you. I can do some extra noise other noises. Hey! Yeah! 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 Stupid wooden sword. Yeah, no, I hate wooden swords. I know it's bad. I'll think of something. Too many of them, buddy. Don't leave that spot, no matter what. You hear me? I got you. Get away from him! Oh no, we got you! Uh, uh, we the spiders in the uh, this place are huge. Get off me! Spam, spam, uh, spam! Uh, uh, pow! Uh, uh, Come on, let's get out of the open. Yeah, grab that string. Never know when it might come in handy. It'll come in handy l later on when we're in the nether. Sorry, I forgot I'll to show say you something. spoiler alert. Not that this isn't a really cool, dimly lit tunnel, but how far away is this thing you want to show me? You don't want to earn a reputation as a wimp. Careful, Jesse. You don't want to get a reputation as a wimp. Y y this isn't my first time in a cave, Petra. Yeah, but have you ever seen a wither, a wither skull? skull? Whoa! Fresh from the nether. You're the first person I've showed it to. I guess going to the scariest place in the world is just another day at work for you, huh? Hey, if I haven't phased down death at least twice before lunch, I'm not living up to my full potential. There's this guy I'm meeting up with at Endercon. <laughs> He's gonna trade me a diamond. You need for a lapis lazuli. Being Sorry, a resident go getter pays off every once in a while. Literally. 
Hey, as long as this guy is willing to pay, I, I earned that diamond. I wow. to say this doesn't wow. sketchy. What? In a single day, you went to the nether, you killed a wither skeleton. I mean, I did build a super cool statue, but still, it's pretty sweet being you, huh? You know, you, you could, could come, come with, with me. me. I mean, if you're too nervous, I totally get it. But I wouldn't mind a little backup. You want me to come with you? Consider it my charitable act for the day. I'll, I'll consider, consider it whatever you want me to consider it, as long so as I get, as to, I get come. to come. You just keep a crafting table down here? Comes in handy. Since that wooden sword of yours got busted... You're, you're giving me a new one? That, Even there. better, you can make you're your own. After it broke. One stick plus two stones equals one sword. Simple trigonometry. Just grab what you need. Oh, okay. Thanks. Hey, is all this stuff yours? No. We're just stealing from whoever was dumb enough to leave us here. Of course it's mine. Just, just making checking. sure. Oh, here we go. Jack. Oh. It always cuts off there. It's the same Just place the pieces on the table. Over each time. See? Isn't it better when you make it yourself? Nope. So someone else makes it for me, that means I, I don't have to go to, to the ta um, to the task Check of out. going and getting all the all it myself. I can't believe it. We won. Axel was right. Everyone loves a creeper. Good for you, Jesse. I know, they're just so cute and cuddly. About time we beat Lucas and his gang of jerks. What kind of stupid name is the Ocelots anyway? You know, Lucas may be kind of arrogant, but he has come through for me in tricky situations. You might want to get to know him, just yeah. in case. He's good at building, that's for sure. It's always useful to have a guy like that around, no matter what you might think of him personally. Yeah, you might be right. Yeah. I'm just saying, if you run into him at Endercon, try talking to him. I don't need a lecture on the power of collaboration, Petra. How about a lecture on the power of my fists? It's short, short, but, but dead. deadly. Come on, let's hurry. Remember what Endercon was like before it was cool? Remember, Remember what, we, what were like we were like before, before we were cool? Some people. Some of us will cool. never be cool. Ha ha. <laughs> Creepers! <sighs> Crap. This doesn't look good. Well, there's only one way off this bridge. Whatever we do, we do it together. All right, let's jump. Yeah, music, music. Intro, credit stuff. Telltale Games presents in association with Mojang. Minecraft Story. the water. You don't land on top of it. Pull yourself together and follow me. Yeah, when I was on vacation, I really, my, my shins were very sore from them because when I jump. So, when we're making the deal, I, have I the, need you to let me do the talking. Directly okay? onto the water. I just don't want anything to screw this up. So. Or anyone. Sure, I'll let you handle it. And if you want to be really useful, try to look intimidating. Like this? 
I'm, I'm less, less scared, scared of, you of you than scared, scared for you. For you. Jesse. And Petra? Hey, you all know Petra, my new yes. super close friend. We're super close now. We ran into each other while I was looking for Reuben. Poor Reuben. What happened to his eye? We had a little run-in with some zombies. They whacked him good, but Reuben held his own. What were you doing in the woods, Petra? Nothing. Just drawn by the sound of Jesse's high-pitched screams. <gasps> I would have been spider-bait if she hadn't found me. Sorry we didn't come with you, Jesse. But hey, we won! Looks like abandoning friends and their time of need paid off yet again. If I didn't know any better, I'd think that creeper was really going to explode. Oh, we did okay, yeah. didn't we? I still wish I'd gotten that part in the back to look better. I could have fit more fireworks in there, somewhere. I'm proud of you guys. Ah, oh, shucks. Don't make me blush. Seriously. Seriously. Don't. Don't. Hey, Jesse, it's time to go see about that thing. Oh, oh right, the thing. Subtle. Subtle. Yeah? As a punch like... to the face. <laughs> Axel and I were going to head into Endercon anyway. See you in there? I heard somebody saying there's free cake by the map booth. Woo! Free cake. Hurry. We're supposed to meet cake. in the alley over there. A free cake. Dark. Dark. Very dark in here. That's weird. He said the dark, creepy alley close to the gates, but... Okay, I'm back. He's not here. Maybe he's late. Are you sure this is the dark, creepy alley he meant? Hmm. I was. Okay, new plan. You stay here, just in case this is the spot he meant, and I'll look around. I guess I could have heard him wrong. Then again, I've never gotten a meetup spot wrong before. Okay, I'll hold down the fort. Thanks, Jesse. I'll be back before you know it. If he shows up while I'm gone, just stall for me. Just who are you? I'm waiting. The name's Jesse. What's it to you? I'm supposed to meet with Petra, not whatever you're supposed to be. Give me one good reason why I shouldn't walk out of here right now. Well? I'm with Petra. My deal is with her. Not her partner. She'll be here, but we can get started without her. Do you have the skull? Uh, well... You do or you don't? Petra has it. She'll be back any minute now. Well, as long as she's bringing it. I suppose it wouldn't kill me to wait a minute longer. Uh, well... Ivor! Ah, here she is. Sorry I'm late, but good things are worth waiting for. I've got what you ask for. If you have what you promised us... You didn't say anything about an us when we first met? And I don't like surprises. If these are the sorts of people you associate with, perhaps we should call the whole thing off. My friend is fine, right, Jesse? There's no problem here. Let's not be too hasty, okay? This is just a little misunderstanding. I'm cool if he's, he's cool. cool. It's settled then. You're both cool. Proceed then. Take it, I'll take it. that diamond now. Take, take it. it. You've earned it. This is my first time playing this game in case you didn't pick that up. Uh, this isn't a diamond. No, it's lapis. Of all the dirty, underhanded tricks to pull. I can't believe that guy got one over on me. I knew we couldn't trust that guy. Screw this. We're going after him. Language. I'm either getting that diamond or I'm getting my skull back. Uh, you make you have it, a, right? Right? Come on. I made it funny. Do you see him anywhere? Nope. And I'm pretty sure Lost. Get him. Then we'll just have to find him. Again. Go. Step aside, I have just one question. 
Hold all your questions until after the keynote. But the keynote sold out. Hold all your questions anyway. What's up? What's up? Nothing. What's up with you? Nothing. What's up with you? I, I just said nothing. Hey, uh, congrats on the win. Well, why, thank you. I mean, I still think our beacon was amazing, but you guys did a pretty good job, too. I mean, I, think I thought the whole monster theme was plenty cool, but fireworks, too? Your beacon wasn't too shabby. You don't have to do that, okay? You guys won fair and square. Yeah. Hey, you didn't happen to see a creepy guy with long hair and a beard roaming around, did you? I don't think so. Why? He kind of scammed Petra out of a diamond earlier. Oh, everyone knows you don't mess with Petra. Not if you know what's good for you. I'll keep an eye out, okay? Thanks, I appreciate it. So, uh, we're cool? Yeah, we're cool. Cool, cool. Cool beans. Cool Rama. <laughs> see you later, Lucas. Yeah, see ya. Daniel, DJ Booth. Wait, I can use it? Oh man, I love this song. What's it called? Too obscure to have a name, huh? Yeah, I kind of figured. Yeah, here you go. Nothing starts the party off right like a great DJ. She can't hear you, man. Stop. Ha ha ha! Thought you could just wiggle right out of that trap, didn't you? Well, wiggle as much as you want. You're not going anywhere. Axel, listen up. Any chance you've seen a creepy-looking, beardy guy anywhere? No. Petra told me what happened. I'm keeping an eye out for him. Okay, so I got a little distracted. It's just this machine presses all my buttons. Unnecessarily complicated and mean to birds for no reason. It's just, when something like this calls, you gotta answer. But I swear, as soon as the demonstration is over, we really need your help, Axel. If we don't find this guy soon, we might never find him. I was looking. I just got distracted. All right, all right, I'll look. After I watch one more chicken get home. Seriously, man? Ha, I see you now, weirdo. Well, if it isn't Team Trash Bag, how's your stupid pig? I hear intense heat causes brain damage. Aiden, you idiot. Hey, who are you calling an idiot? You, yeah. now move. Hey. Got good. This get first eye door. Hey, what do you think you're... What do you think you're doing? Oh. Well, guys, I think that's going to be it for this episode of Minecraft Story Mode. Hopefully you guys will really like it. I hope you guys liked it. Anyway, um, in the next episode we're going to finish the remainder of Chapter 1 of Minecraft Story Mode and and we will be Good to go. So, if you guys enjoyed the video, uh, leave a like. Uh, leave a like down below, and 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 if you're new to the channel, click subscribe, and and click that little bell bell icon icon on on uh, on so you get notified whenever I, uh, I upload a video. So, without further ado, Bloxwest has left the building.